Hey guys, welcome to I'll Be Dram. Today we're bringing you a bottle called Brothers Bond. This is the cash strength version. Um, this is from the guys that start in Vampire Diaries. Robinson, tell us a little bit about this bottle. Okay, undisclosed mash bill, but it is distilled in Indiana. They didn't give us an age statement, but it is 114.08 proof. Uh, price is around $80 on this bottle. Um, like I said, it's... Uh, started by the um the guys from vampire diaries yeah ian and paul so what was the ian's last name again uh something like summer halter I there you go. Yeah, there you walter go. hagen yeah. something <laughs> yeah you know i'm not an expert on the on this show but um yeah if Dude, a lot of people follow the, follow the show and they were pretty excited by the fact that they were coming out with a product yeah i, and, I think they were just really excited about the guys <laughs> yeah, right. and then probably. they're like hey you drink bourbon <laughs> right and that's how we got introduced to it right yeah, right so um but we did have the original version which was the small batch version which yeah. was not great actually. yeah it, it, it was not tasted a little like it, it needed some more time yeah, yeah. yeah it was, it was yeah. a little young tasted yeah. like the brothers weren't that bonded no <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, let's see what the cast drinks about. I haven't had this one yet. I know y'all have already got into it a little bit, but I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> it came like that. <laughs> yeah, that's the new. They drink decanting style. The first third, so that way they know it's good. We had quality control, <laughs> right? Oh, I really like that palate. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, it's yummy. Very, uh, very like good. some creamy nutmeg. Okay. <laughs> What's creamy nutmeg? I'm not sure. Okay. I, I turned to you for clarification. Okay. <laughs> you, explain yes. explain uh, yourself. Yes. Yeah, we need more. We need so more. I was reading um, Robin's notes. <laughs> I think nougat is what you're looking for. Oh, nougat. nougat. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you need some new contacts. Tell me about it because it's blurry. Yeah. But for those at home, creamy nutmeg, look for it at your grocery stores. Right. <laughs> it's a it's new Nutella product. You put nutmeg in milk. Done. Mm. That's milky nutmeg. <laughs> okay, you put it in half and half. Is that just half nut? <laughs> Half nut, half water. What's the mash bill on this? Oh, they, they don't say. Yeah, it's undisclosed. Um, and I, I don't even know if we're actually working with a single mash bill. Yeah, that, I don't that think so. Because part of it's a little, like, it, it feels like it's a weeded. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it, it very well could be that we don't, we don't know. It's like Werther's Originals feel. Right, it's definitely very, very yeah, caramel. Caramel, food. yeah. Right. Yeah, for sure. Um, If this is MGP considering this is coming out in Indiana, um, it's not what I would expect. Mm -hmm. So, like, it kind of makes me think we might be working with more than one mash bill. Yeah, could be, I, I we, we they could be are. blending a, a few different mash bills, definitely different barrels, you know. Yeah, if anybody out there knows, you know, specifics on, on the mash bill here, we would love to know. Mm -hmm. I'm getting some, some uh, on the nose and on the palate, some oak and yeah. cinnamon cinnamon for I'm sure. getting more cinnamon toward the finish yeah the finish is, is that's that's definitely yeah. there the finish is like a snickerdoodle okay, okay. yeah yeah Christmas time mm -hmm. but it is good I, like this is a little bit um, I was thoroughly impressed like I couldn't off profile this was, from this was one of those bottles that we ran across we we're walking mm -hmm. through the store Kyle goes hey there's that brother spawn cast strength and I was like oh I hate you I'm pretty sure I said that in the store. You did yeah. a couple times. Yeah. I was like, oh, I hate you. And I picked it up and I walked around the store with it because we'd already had the Brothers Bond, the regular one, and yeah. which wasn't yeah, was very not. impressive. Mm -mm. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do it. And yeah. literally got it home that day, opened it, and was like, oh. I'd be curious to know if the cast strength version has any more age on it or if we're just talking about it hasn't been. This is uncut, unfiltered. Right. Like, it... it doesn't seem to have the same profile and no. it, i don't mm -mm. it yeah, doesn't don't come across as particularly thing. it doesn't come uh, across as particularly old but it also doesn't have that youth youthfulness right. that we were getting on the um mm. the, the standard, standard. The small batch yeah and also what was the proof on the small batch was it 80 80 80, 80 it, might have, it was either 86 it, yeah i don't think it, it was, was it was sub 90, 90. yeah, yeah. 
Ja. <laughs> Mark has twin turbo engines. No, I hope that's I on camera I, because I that, that, actually we're not even gonna cut this. Yeah, that's, no, a, that's a stink bug, and we all were just mesmerized that by that the stink bug. That was the stink bug flying he, in a 747. <laughs> That was a prop plane that just flew through here. I don't, I don't know what that was. Yeah. <laughs> All right. That was, yeah, that was definitely aggressive. Said, do not edit that out. Yeah, just no, keep it and if it's not there, somebody make the sound that it made so I can edit it over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That, that's hilarious. That was real aggressive. Yeah. So what so was the proof what, on this? 114.08, I believe. Yeah, so I'd be curious to know if it's an age thing or if it's just a proof thing or if it's both that made this substantially better. Yeah. I, yeah this is uh, wild. you grab this yeah. in NC? No. No? I haven't seen it in North Carolina. I haven't seen it in North Carolina. not saying it's not here. I'm just saying I haven't feel, seen it. I mean, I truth be told, I've only seen it in ago, one store remember. in South Carolina. Right. Yeah, I think I was, was in Liquor South Carolina when I saw it. Yeah, it was Liquor Delight. Okay. Okay. Because I was... Which we're going to need a sponsorship. Yeah. Hey, if yeah. they ever see these videos, they right. need, you know. <laughs> we'll start hashtagging liquor to like. Yeah. In the YouTube. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Works. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, overall, I mean, 80 only, bucks. That's what I was about to get know, to. The only thing I don't like about this is $80. I, I would like to see this more at like $65. $65, 70 tops. Yeah. 80 is a little stretch here. I don't know if I'll go snatch up another. I don't know if I'll go buy a backup to my backup. But, you know what I mean? no, but also, Brittany might buy it for you. In, in some ways, Maybe. we are a little bit a living in the fan. past because everything does keep on. Everything is just like more expensive with bourbon now. Yeah. Everything, oh, every, when a new product comes out, $80 is like the starting price now. You know, that's yeah. kind of. If it's more of a crafty, mm-hmm. you know, not a and coming out of a big distillery. I don't know what actual retail is, though, because we did pick this up in yeah, South I don't Carolina. Know what so I don't know what, if it this. did pop up in North Carolina, I don't know what retail would be. Uh, yeah, it's eighty dollars. Is okay. Yeah, uh, when he's yeah. pretty good about. Well, I know. Yeah. if it's not something special. Yeah, I actually didn't yeah. even. Whenever I pulled that price off of off of their website. Okay, it's, it's like the manufacturer MSLP. Okay. Yeah. yeah. All right, but I mean. I mean, but for value wise, I would say yes, a little bit cheaper would be nicer. But I mean, that's really... I don't feel like I'm hurt at eighty dollars. No, so. no, definitely I, not. I was nervous when you bought it. I was yeah, also me too. Please, because to of the <laughs> because we had the other one, and right. I'm like, oh, if this is gonna suck, I'm glad he spent the money. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, I, I we must have finished the other bottle, like yeah. by the pool or something. I don't know, yeah. but well, it, it was fine for right, but. Because I looked for that bottle to put them head to head and see if we could mm-hmm. pick out the actual differences, but I don't think that would have even been good after doing this. Like, yeah, I don't yeah, think so either. Yeah. It would have trashed your palate. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. So I mean I mean what else? I mean it's a good bottle. Go buy this yeah. bottle. Go yeah. buy it. Yeah, it's a good yeah, bottle. Go buy this bottle. Hey, and the guys from Vampire's Diary, if you want to send us another one signed for the wives. Oh, that would be great. We'll take four. Yeah, so we'll Big we'll, uh, we'll hashtag that in the video too, right? Yeah, hashtag. Yeah, so uh, I don't really know what else. Sorry we can about add other trashing than your this other stuff, a, but this stuff's good. This is a good bottle. Um, I'd be interested to see something that's more aged. I know that's a young, you know, they're doing young mm-hmm. stuff here, so I would be interested to see if they did drop an eight-year, ten-year product down yeah, the road. Yeah, just something age stated because let's just say that it maybe is near four to six years, mm-hmm. something in that range. Yeah, at eight. Actually, did you find yeah. out what was the barrel entry on this? Any idea? That this is they didn't disclose really anything about okay. that kind of stuff. So I mean, that would be interesting to know too of what the barrel entry when this went in mm-hmm. age statement and now it comes out at you know one fourteen. So yeah, I mean, because that's a very specific point. right mm-hmm. point oh four right not point four point oh four, four right point oh eight it's point oh eight yeah you're right I know point oh four was it was it was. Half the legal limit. Account for yeah, yeah. So yeah. I would be interested to see kind of all those things and see if they did put out something that was mm-hmm. a little more had a little more age to it. Because if they're basing off of this mash bill coming out cash strength, I mean, this is good. I, mm-hmm. I, I would imagine that whatever comes out next would be better, right? right? Theoretically, yeah. yeah, yeah, right. All right. What else? Anything? Anybody else get peppermint on the finish? 
Actually, yes, yeah. I was just thinking that. Okay. And like a sweet peppermint, like yeah. a holiday peppermint. I got a like little bit left salt. here. Let me, let me see like if I... Or like a wedding... What do they call them? Like a wedding peppermint? Like the colorful mints that are sitting out by oh, the table? Oh, yeah, the little pillow-looking yeah. ones. Yeah, yeah, nah. Nope. Yeah. That last little <laughs> yeah. drop, I got it. No, I did. It was like a sweet mint. And maybe it was just the hung out by itself long enough it changed. Hmm. You guys shouldn't have Maybe you didn't it. wash your glass out very well. That could also be <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. Well, this was the Brothers Bond cast drink. Go pick this bottle up. Make sure you like the video. Subscribe to it. Um, any of Vampire Diaries fans out there, if y'all have any information on this bottle, let us know where I'll be drammed. We'll see you next time. That was yeah. aggressive. Yeah, that was <laughs> aggressive. <laughs>